Hello friends, welcome to Suresh Agarwal's Mathematics Shortcuts and the Learning Loop app. This is the complete course on division and divisibility and you are learning some of the Vedic mathematics methods which can be applied to divide numbers really, really smartly. In this video, I am going to take up division by 13 and division by 19. So when you have to divide any number by 13 or any number by 19, you can find the answer in decimals very easily using some amazing Vedic Maths methods. Let's take the example where we have to divide a three digit number by 13. So 749 by 13. So the first thing I am going to do is to convert 749 by 13 as a mixed number. And I've done it for you already so that we can save time. 57 8 upon 13 is the mixed number form of 749 upon 13. Now I know that my answer is going to end, start with rather 57 and after decimal I want to find that part. Now the intention of this video is to tell you what will be the decimal part of the answer. So 57 point something. Now if you see 8 upon 13, the numerator here is 8. I'll consider that numerator as n and then I'll multiply. See, there are some particular steps which are involved. So if you follow those steps, you will get the decimal part. The first thing is you have to multiply 8 by a constant 7 and you will get 56 and then multiply 56 by another constant 11 and you will get 616. Then the number which you have got just take the difference of that number and 1. That means you have to reduce that number by 1. You will get 615. And surprisingly, this 615 will be the first three digits after decimal in the quotient. Now, you may stop here if you don't want more digits. But if you want three more digits, then we just have to take the nines complement of the number. That is the nines complement of 616. How do you take the nines complement? 9 minus 6, 9 minus 1, and 9 minus 6 again. So that is 383. Three. So the last three digits of the quotient will be 383. Three. And obviously, this will go on and on, but we have found out the quotient up to six decimal places. Now pick up your calculators and check. 749 divided by 13 should be 57.615383. That's how you find the decimal part of any number divided by 13. Remember this 7 and this 11 and then subtraction like this. You have to subtract 1. They are fixed numbers which you have to use in all examples in which you are dividing by 13. Let's see another question in which now we are trying to divide a three digit number by 19. So again, the same thing applies here, 463 divided by 19. So we'll write it as a uh, fraction first and then reduce it to a mixed number, which I've already done for you, 24, 7 upon 19. Now this is the mixed number form of 463 upon 19. After that, we just have to consider that the answer is 24 point something and that something can be found out using a rule. And what is that rule? Let's do that rule now. So 7 upon 19 has the numerator 7. So the first thing you are going to do is to take half of 7. And if you divide 7 by 2, you will get a quotient and a remainder. The quotient will obviously be 3 and the remainder will be 1. Now, Remember these quotients which you are getting, they will get you the decimal part of your answer. So you got 3 and a 1 and now you have to use a simple formula which is 10 times remainder plus quotient upon 2. Now this is the short trick which you can use for the next step. So if you put quotient as 3 and remainder as 1, you will get this as uh, 13 by 2 and 13 by 2 if you divide 13 by 2 the quotient will be 6 and the remainder will be 1 and now you can put 6 and 1 again in this formula you will get 10 times 1 
which is 10 plus 116. So you get a 16 by 2 and when you divide 16 by 2, you will have a quotient 8 and a remainder 0. Now you can carry on this uh, method. You can find as many steps you want. But if you do the next step, you put 8 and 0 in this formula again, you will get 8 upon 2, which is 4. So 4 and obviously the remainder will be 0 and 4 upon 2 will give you 2 and the remainder will be 0 again. So I think these many decimal places should be enough. So the answer for the question is this. 24.36842 and it will go on and you can check now just pick up the calculator 463 divided by 19 is going to give you this decimal number.